zombie eyeballs. We've got zombies, ghouls and vampires. Perfect for Halloween, very easy to make and they even taste good. Hello everyone and welcome to Cheeky Richo's Halloween special. Today we're making ghouls and vampires eyeballs. You'll need some boiled eggs, some pickled onions, gherkin, olives and tomato paste. We cut up eggs in half widthways. Now we get a sharp knife and make random squiggles, not too deep, down the side of our eyeballs. This is to simulate bloodshot veins. Now we cut the tops of the pointy ends This is the messy part. We get a bit of tomato paste and we just smear it on the outside of our eyeballs. Give it a little squeeze at the same time to ensure that the paste is actually able to go into each of the veins. You don't need very much, you're going to be wiping off the excess anyway. Just tap the excess off on a bit of paper towel and there you have it. One bloodshot goo eyeball. Our first goo will have green eyes so get a, a very sharp knife and cut a ring of pickled onion from the centre. Then we pop it on top of our eyeball. Now we get a black olive And we get a, a thick, strong walled straw and punch a hole in it. See that? Now it's going to be hard to get that out, so get a thinner straw, put it in the centre, and pop it out so that pops it out. We have a perfectly round pupil. Now because it's still quite thick, if you cut that, that cutting myself here, down the center, you should have two pupils. So pop one pupil on top of our eyeball. Let's do a vampire eyeball now. We'll get a red one, slice it down the center, take a thin sliver from the center, get another one of our eyeballs Put our vampire one on top of it and pop our pupil on top of that. There you have another eyeball. Let's push it into shape a little bit. They don't have to be perfect, don't forget they've been wrenched out of a vampire's eyeball socket. Get a pickled gherkin and do the same thing. A round sliver, a 
couple of those. We'll pop our eyeballs on there. Punch a hole in our punch a hole in our olive like so. Just push the straw through and that will release it. Cut that into halves again. And you have two pupils. One on top of each grizzly eyeball. Look real, don't they? You could use a pin to make your wiggly lines. Just squeeze the egg a little to open up those bloodshot veins. A little more tomato paste on the tip of your finger. Squeeze it apart a little so that the veins are filled up with the tomato paste. Tap off the excess. Another eye on top and another pupil. Zombie eyeballs. There you have it. Zombie eyeballs. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you very much for watching. And don't forget to leave me a comment, a thumbs up, or even subscribe for more delicious recipes.